Hello everyone, today I have a time capsule of old American Girl of Today items to unbox for you. I am so excited. These items are from the mid-90s, 1996 to the early 2000s. And I just get so excited about opening these old items because they're such treasures. <laughs> the quality is so much higher than things American Girl makes today. So, the first thing I pull out is this bag of clothes. Oh, this is in beautiful condition. This is the first day meat jacket, which is the second meat outfit for the American Girl Today dolls. This is an amazing quality. I have this for one of my dolls. This is the outfit one of my dolls came in, in fact, and mine is so much more loved than this one. This is barely used. This even has the little stick-on grin pins that used to come with every outfit. I can take them off if I, if I want them, if I want to, but they're so cute brings back memories. Next thing I pull out, this is the hat for the cargo outfit, which came out around 2000, 1999. This is one of my personal favorite outfits. That's these are the cargo pants. They even have a working drawstring and real pockets on the side. The next thing I pull out or some accessories. A couple of scrunchies from the 90s. This one is from the first day outfit that goes with the jacket. This one is from the red vinyl jumper meat outfit, which is the next meat outfit after the first day. This is one of the little mini mags. This one came in the red vinyl jump jumper meat accessories. really read it. I miss the mini mags so much. There's a little hair care for your doll hang tag that came with the doll originally. This is a tiny notebook ne necklace. I've always wanted this. It's so cute. It really opens. And this real page is inside. Here are a few more grin pens. This is the gray shirt that goes with the cargo outfit. The cargo outfit also has a red and green flannel shirt. This 
This has faux buttons and snaps up. Here is the shirt for the first day meet outfit. The striped mock tee, turtleneck style. Again, much better condition than the one I have. This person hardly uses this clothing at all. Teal socks from the first day outfit. I actually never got these. So I'm happy to have these myself. We have two pairs of underwear. This one is the first day underwear. This is the red vinyl jumper underwear. Back in the day, you could purchase the meat outfit separately. If you had a doll who wanted a meat outfit and you didn't want to buy another doll, These are the pants, the, the first, first style of pants from the first day meet outfit, because these are velvet. This material changed um, in the next year, in 1997, and it became like a stretchy fabric, but it wasn't, wasn't velour like this is. Another outfit that came in this lot is the year 2000 outfit. The perfect New Year's Eve outfit. It's purple and pink and blue shimmery tank top. Matching cardigan. Shirt or skirt, I mean, has a zipper on the side. Thick, sparkly tights. There were also accessories that came with this outfit that you had to buy separately. That included a year 2000 headband and party poppers and a, and a purse, but I didn't get that with this set. So there's another bag over here. Um, here is the other bag of goodies. Okay, these are my favorite shoes ever. These are the sneakers that go with the cargo outfit. They have the AGOT logo on the bottoms, real bases. These are the lace-up sandals that go with the Y2K outfit, year 2000 outfit. Again, they also have the American Girl Today logo on the bottoms. I wanted that outfit so bad as a kid. Each outfit back then used to come with a hanger. The historicals would get an, a historical hanger, the American Girls collection hanger. And these were the modern hangers. This is the purse that came with the red vinyl jumper and meat accessories. Inside. There is a library card. It says Jennifer on it. And 
and a school lunch ticket. I love little things like that. And there's a little pocket inside for the cards and a little Velcro with a little wallet with $3. And this is really cool because the money is printed on both sides, unlike the new money that comes only one-sided. believe this probably came with the year 2000 outfit. You're invited to an American Girl party. It's just an advertisement for the party set American Girl used to sell. I always thought these were really cool. Tropical Bash, Hollywood Premiere, Pajama Jam, Sock Hop, different plates and, and favor bags and and props that you could use for your next birthday party. Rock and sock hop. I always thought that was neat. Disposable camera. This is really cool. It's an advertisement for American Girl Place. back when there was only one in Chicago. Order form. And every American Girl Today doll back then came with a blank book where you could write your story. Actually, the ones in 1995 came with all six books, like the historical dolls. But then this got changed to just one book. There's a writer's guide written by Valerie Tripp. Oh wow, this is going to be so fun to read. The owner filled this out for her doll, Jennifer. Her birthday, June 27th, 1988. Cool. The main problem your character has is she is always moving, so she has one friend. I love it. This is so cool. I'm so glad she wrote in this. And here's the book. This still blank. This is actually an Amelia bag. Amelia was a character in the American Girl magazine in the 90s. And they um, produced some books, uh, some of her books, and there was a Amelia rag doll and different little accessories you could buy for yourself. And this is just a little plastic bag that something came in. I love Amelia. If you guessed that there was a doll inside, you were right. This is the box the doll came in. 
Originally it came with a little American Girl of Today um, cardboard belt type thing around it. I'm so excited. I have wanted this doll since I was seven years old. And this doll is from the year where when I was seven years old, so that makes it even more special. There she is. It is American Girl of Today. Uh, I can't talk. It is American Girl Today number 12 with blonde hair, bangs, and brown eyes. This is the doll that I wanted as a child because she sort of looked like me. And I just was gaga over her the entire time I was looking at the catalog. Like, why can I get this doll? Why can't I get this doll? But. I was a one American Girl doll child back then. My mom didn't buy me another doll for um, a few years and and then other dolls started coming out. It's like, and I just didn't get her and I still wanted her, but I didn't get her. And so here I am finally getting the doll of my childhood dreams. I am so excited I can't talk. I don't think the red vinyl jumper is her main outfit. I think she came in the first day outfit. However, I'm not positive because they did sell the first day outfit separately. This is the first day outfit, this outfit. Um, but it was sold separately when this was the main outfit. So I don't, I'm not quite sure. I do know that she has some coloring, which is not typical of 96 dolls. So she might be a 98 doll. But that's okay. I love her. I love the older American Girl Today's doll so much. This outfit is really cute. However, this is the fourth dress I've had. So I do not expect it to last. The first one I got peeled. And this one's starting to peel. Because that's what vinyl does. And then the second and third dresses, which actually belonged to my mom, peeled too. So this one probably will not last much longer. I hope to have it made out of a corduroy someday. Because it's so cute. So 90s. But so cute. Fun fact, I really hated this dress when it came out. It has since grown on me, but... It doesn't last, so I'm trying not to let it grow on me again. It comes with these cute little argyle tights, which are really thick. Nice boots, which are exactly like kits, however they are black. And this black turtleneck. The beret comes with the accessories. It's so cute. Her hair needs to be brushed some. But I think it's overall in good condition.
I am tempted to keep her name Jennifer because apparently that was her name. But I've had her name picked out for years, so please meet Alexis Siobhan Connor. Finally, my number 12. She is so very nostalgic for me. I'm just so happy right now. Here's a look at everything I got. The cargo outfit actually came with a navy zip-up hoodie too. It's missing from the lot, but that's okay because I actually already have it. this a lot and it just nostalgia took hold of me and it like said get me <laughs> this makes me so happy as a 90s child what's your favorite era of American Girl is there anything you wish American Girl would go back to thanks for watching Tell me, well, I guess you can't tell me because I don't have comments, but if you want to DM me on Instagram at Starry Eyes Chick and tell me about your favorite American Girl of Today items, feel free. I would love to hear it. Thanks for watching. Bye. She has beautiful hazel eyes, medium skin, and blonde hair. Dark blonde, to be specific. She comes with this beautiful cupcake dress. With this beautiful purple polka dotted skirt. Leggings. 